Hey, what's up, guys? It's Will in here. And after that game, the Seattle Seahawks beat the Cowboys, ending their playoff hopes, ending their dreams of ever going to the playoff this year. The, the Seattle Seahawks defense did great. As a matter of fact, the whole team did great. But what happened after the game was a little crazy to me. I can't really believe it right now. I'm just looking at it right now. My man Earl Thomas ran straight up to the coach Jason Garrett and asked him, if you have a chance, please come get me. Like what? I mean, I understand there are. I know the Seattle Seahawks got a lot of drama going on with their defense, man. I know these guys aren't liking each other, but these guys could win games even if they not even not even good communication right now. You know what I'm saying? They ain't got good chemistry right now, and they're still winning games. Their defense is still looking sharp. I don't under I don't understand what is going on with the Seattle Seahawks, man. I mean, they're not caring about each other. I mean, I. I've seen Richard Sherman. Sherman, he said, like, I think he said, like, a while ago, hey, just trade me. He didn't even care if they traded him, man. Like, he was arguing with his, uh, he was arguing with his, I think, DB. He was arguing with one of the defensive backs on his team. Like, he was yelling at him, all this, miss, misplays, all of that. I was just like, man. Now, this, now I see what everything leading up to, all the Twitter rants that the team been doing, the players. Now, this is what it's ending up to right here, man. This is what it's coming to. Like, come on, say like y'all defense is great, man. Y'all got the y'all got one of the best defenses in the league, man. Can't nobody really fuck with y'all. But y'all just wanna leave like that. But I don't understand what's going on. In, in my opinion, if I wish they could just get back along like they used to, be the great defense that they used to be. But obviously I think they're way past that now. I think they all just wanna get away from each other, man. And it's sad because that defense was really like that defense with Richard Sherman, like, come on, man. Like, Ch Chancellor, like, these guys, man, Earl Thomas, like, they were so great. With Marshawn Lynch, all of them, they were all great. They were a great team all around. And now, now that his players will see this, I mean, they're going to just be like, man, yeah, we can't fuck with him at all. I'm pretty sure they weren't even fucking with him then because he, he literally at, like, they, like, they just don't care no more. And they have a winning season right now. They're 8-6. and six. Their playoff hope is still high right now. I mean... I just don't get it right now. It's sad. It's t it's very sad to me, man. That was a great defense, man. But after this, I think they're just going to crumble apart, man. I don't know what the coach was doing. I don't know if he tried to help this relationship. I don't know if he even cares, man. Because he hasn't came out and said nothing about their relationship, man. So I'm wondering how he feels personally about this. But anyway, you guys, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below, man. Gee, just let me know what you guys think of this in general. Please let me know. Because I need to know what you guys are thinking about this. Anyway, please like and subscribe. It's your boy Will Lynn, and I'm out.